with us in Jesus' name. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Amen. Tuinue mikono tumshukuru Bwana kwa ubali ambao ametutoa na ubali ambao anatupeleka. Najua ni wengi wangependa kufika mahali hapa. Yes, wengi nao wamelemewa. Yes, Wengine wamefujika mioyo. Yes. Wengine wamekosa nia na sababu. Yes, Lakini Mungu umetuleta. Yes, Twasongea mbele zako uziku wa leo. Yes, Jioni ya leo baba yetu na Mungu wetu. Yes. Saidia yote tukisema wastahili Bwana. Wastahili. wastahili baba yetu. Wastahili. Ulisugumsia na ukatwambia. Yes. Ahustaji mambo mingi kutoka kwetu. Yes, Unajua mahitaji zetu. Yes. Unajua kilio chetu yes, Unajua mwisho wetu yes, Hata vita zetu unasijua baba yes, Lakini unahitaji tu yes. Shukra ni kutoka kwetu yes, Na diyo mana tumeugana hapa yes. Ata kama hatutajetedewa yes. Wewe ni mungu yes, Ata kama tumetendewa yes, Utaishi kuwa mungu yes. Baba adhuhuri jema yes, Tunataka kutumbu dhabize tunamakosa Wengine wamenugunika baba yangu yes. Wameona kama safari imekuwa kubwa sana yes. wameona kama we mungu ni mungu wa mapendeleo yes, wameona kama mungu hausiki yes. lakini bwana tuasema ni asante, asante yes. tusamehe baba yangu inge penda uobe msamaha beleza bwana labda umege ungunika umemwona mungu kama sio mwaminifu kuna mambo unaona umekalishiwa tusame, lakini kukalishiwa sio kuwekewa reka basha dararabagoria rima sheketele Mababo we want to surrender, we surrender our afflictions, our trials, our temptation, Lord. Take initiative, oh God. Era gayo e danyari akere no giaku. Era gayo e danyari akere no giaku. Era gayo e danyari ago shari deli oguaku. Muera muadani o ya danya. Wana muadani o ya danya. Maudo makune meko agera. Gara ya kune ko yora gado. We ambau me God chea. We ambau na na kama hakuji. Una fikiri ya kujiongosha mwambie bwana shukua ushukani shukua ushukani baba yangu kwa maana ukishukua ushukani mambo yote yatawezekana katika jina la Yesu nataka mshukuru bwana kwa mwezi wa pili kumekuwa na mafumbi kumekuwa na mapito wengi tungekufa wengi tungesahaulika lakini kuna kitu moja nimekuletea siku ya leo when the hand of God is upon you. Oh, yes, no Lord. other hand yes, can Lord. be able to fight you. Oh, yes. Appreciate the hand of God you, to be upon you, you in Lord. every storm, Thank in you, every Jesus. situation, Thank in you, every calamity, in Lord. every trials, Thank in every Lord. temptation. Thank the you, hand of God oh, yes. has been upon us. Hallelujah. We love you, Daddy, Thank for you, this 28th day. Yes, you Lord. have a neighbor, dear yes, Father, Lord. to be in your presence, yes, to stand here, dear your father yes, to express our thanksgiving Thank you, to Jesus. say that you are worthy Thank you are lord. worthy lord Thank you are worthy lord. jehovah Thank you, worthy lord. is your name Thank we you, exalt you daddy yes, reke makanda rarababo zakayanda kama haugekuwa upande wetu maandui wangetu meza kama haugekuwa upande wetu wengi wangekuwa kaburini kama haugekuwa upande wetu wengi tugesa haorika but you have been there for us. Yes, we say thank you, thank Father. You, Lord. Thank you for the month of thank February. You, thank you for the battles. Thank, thank you, you for the sicknesses. Thank you, thank you for everything. Thank we you, appreciate you, thank Father. You, we worship you. Thank you, Bwana Makovi Matuli. Ata kama ulikuja na jam. Ata kama haukukula kitu. Ata kama hauna zagemeo. Mwere mwada nine wega. Mwere mwada nine wagere ire. Nene ya hana asokiri ya gado. Wakati hana ali 
alimshukuru bwana aliongezewa watoto watano wakati alimshukuru na akamwambia bwana mimi ndiye yule mwanamke ambaye alikuwa amesimama hapa god is telling me to tell you to stop mummering to stop complaining to stop blame game in everything that you are going through jehovah god is together with you just say oh god thank you lord wele mwana ni nelega nelega ni kohigerwa nyopa nelega ni kwaga school fees nelega moda makibata nelega jesu wito oh god show na rakumia you do ama do mada magorete makita nigeza wa parare makita nigeza gosho makita nigeza nene hapoda ni sita nugunika sita teta sita zidara sita kulisa maswali i come to say thank you i come to say thank you thank you for the spirit of the living god thank you our own right followers whoever you are i express my thanks giving to you you have been there for me since january to data you have been following me trusting my god praying together with me praying for me fighting for me we express our thanks giving let us pray for our online followers what love are they here nothing has stopped them not to follow me not to love me not to go together with me we thank you we bless you we honor you we take thanks for you for trusting our ministry for trusting our god for working together with us we say thank you as we close this mother father i pray for increase because we never god we give you thanks you increase your people you increase their ideas you increase their might you multiply them dear father as i usher them to the month of march lord number three is the number of the trinity may you have visitation may you have visitation god the father god the son god the holy spirit walk together with us be with us lord we are going to conquer yes, and we are going to speak oh, yes. to the month of march yes, march will give you favor Amen. march will give you favor Amen. march will complete Amen. whatever you have not completed oh, yes. i hear god telling me yes, in the month of march yes. you will complete Amen. that project Amen. you started that on january Amen. and now not yet oh, yes. because when the hand of god rama yes. handa babu i see the hand of god i see the hand of god kuna watu wameondolewa usaidizi kuna watu wameondolewa msahanda kuna watu wamerushanishwa kuna watu wameondolewa the yashasa but i hear god telling me to come and encourage somebody until somebody this mother matter the hand of god who make you go through the hand of god who rest upon you in wa mikono yako karibisha mkono wa bwana karibisha mkono wa bwana dear god i surrender i surrender my father i have tried with my own meaning with my own effort with my own hand with my own hand and it has not yet lord i invite your hand i invite your mighty hand i invite the hand of god karibisha mkono wa bwana karibisha mkono wa bwana katika hiyo biashara katika hiyo biashara katika hiyo doa katika yale mahano re mahanda mikono ya wanadamu inaweza ikapungukiwa mikono ya wanadamu ikaweza ikalegea but when the hand of god is upon your life he make everything to happen for good in the mighty name of jesus we need your hand we need your hand lord in this ministry my father we need your hand my god people may disappear people may refuse people may run away but whenever lord you are omnipresent whenever your hand is upon your life it will deliver you from temptation from trials from shame from anything from witchcraft from powers of darkness in the power upon your life mipaka yote umeinuliwa na shetani akaapa ya kwamba hauta 
kufuka na hautakila karibisha mkono wa Bwana karibisha mkono wa Bwana karibisha mkono wa Bwana i want to see somebody rene keterere baba yanda yote yawezekana na mkono wa Bwana mkono wa Bwana ukeberekana na wewe unakupigania kwa maadui unakupatia shakura unakuongelesha unakukibisha kwa kila chapo in the mighty name of Jesus i really is an anointing upon you right now i decree and declare battles of february you will not fight them again every battle of february whatever you have been fighting february as you need fight the hand of god it will not fail you anymore you are battles are defeated you are walls are defeated your frustrations are defeated inwa mikono yako kuna uwepo wa bwana unashuka mahali hapa mwambie bwana vita nimepitia february maugonjwa nimepitia february masauti nimesikia february let your hand let stop on me dear father fight for me my god i refuse to enter masha with the battles of february i battle them now i join myself with the mighty hand of our Lord Jesus Christ I fight the battles of February fight the battles of February they are called help me lord rebeke terera baboria rama katarara baba yanda machozi umeria february kuinukiwa umeinukiwa february may the hand of god address every issue and whatever the devil is planning to frustrate you in masha i stand here as a servant of god with the anointing of elisha elisha was a man of god like me i decree and declare to every hand of the enemy to every weapon of the enemy to every might of the enemy to every career of the enemy whatever they are planning to go ahead to your mind to frustrate you may the hand of god may the hand of god the mighty hand of god the powerful hand of god the hand of almighty god raka mahando bezeketae overturn every giant overturn every giant overturn every giant can you go ahead and ask the hand of god to overturn every giant to overturn every giant to overturn every barrier to destroy every network mkono wa bwana shuka juu ya watu wako shuka juu yangu shuka kwa haya madhabahu shuka baba yangu ukatende nasi kama vile upendavyo in jesus name i pray amen in jesus name i pray amen sabimia watu watano neema ya bwana ukawaambie karibisha mkono wa bwana nenea mtu mwambie bwana hata kama umelemewa mnenee mwambie hata kama umelemewa na unaona kama utaurusha mikono welcome the hand of god because when the hand of god is upon you everything will submit under the authority of god so many things may refuse to work on your place but when god introduces his hand upon your life you will do greater you will do wonders miracle and wonders shall follow you prophesy to somebody mwambie kenya umele Kenya umelemewa. Kenya umelemewa. Kenya umelemewa. Karibisha mkono wa Bwana. Karibisha mkono wa Bwana. Karibisha mkono wa Bwana. Karibisha mkono wa Bwana. Kuna tulikuwa tunaimba tukasema ya kwamba waka kwa Jehova kwenyati kwa juu neko na kana ya magadi ya ine waka kwa Jehova Kwenyati kwa juu neko na kana ya magadi ya ine Nasikia Bwana Kadri thank you so much for reading an international praise and worship amen i feel the anointing mom amen. come and greet amen. me because you did extra
extra and extra and extra. Stretch your heart oh, yes, to bless this girl. She did Jesus. an amazing. Those three of days Jesus. of revival, oh, yes, she Lord. was there interceding yes. and standing on behalf of this church. Oh, yes. And I'm trusting God revival has come yes. through your sacrifices, oh, yes. through your worship, yes. through your everything. Oh, yes. How I pray from today. Yes, oh. Whatever has been hindering yes. you, whatever has been fighting you, oh, yes. as you have brought revival yes. in our nation oh, yes. with an anointing of a great servant of God than he yes. may God lift you in up Jesus name. may God lift you in up Jesus name. receive name that anointing Jesus. anointing of a reprifting yes. you will be lifted higher oh, and yes. higher and no voice of the enemy mm. that will bring you down yes, in Lord. Jesus name I bless you Amen. appreciate God Hallelujah. I saw you and I was very happy when I was looking at you I was seeing Grace Chapel presented there. Appreciate God for Hallelujah. my daughter. It was not easy. How to get to the house to Ivo. But I was able to get to the house to Ivo. I was able to get to Now our online followers, I bless you so much. Our dear and loving evangelist Catherine Getau. God bless you and Gubi. God bless you. Pastor Flores, God bless you. Reverend Royce, God bless you. Jose, Jose, God bless you. Martin Janet, God bless you. Stephen Moshira, God bless you. William Minor, God bless you. Masse, Masse, God bless you. All of you. Thank you so much. The topic that God has put in me. When I was trying to ask God, yesterday you can be seated in the presence of God. Yesterday we were not able to come for for there was a lot of heat rough and when I was asking God what is happening he told me that he has washed away all the sins of our nation that was a sign after the man of God Bwana aliosha uchafu wote wa Kenya na dio mana akaniambia leo ni mlete mkono wa Bwana kwa sababu mkono wa Bwana ukiwa juu yako haijarishi watu wanasema nini haijarishi ni mambo magani yanakaa kama haiendi poa when the hand of God is upon you signs and wonders will rocket you by all means in the mighty name of Jesus you don't need a lot of effort when i was speaking when i was teaching about poverty you can remember there was that scripture that to told us that we don't need to wake up during the night to go and work hard we only need the heart of god and the word of god when the word of god is imprinted katika maisha yako itafanya mambo ya maajabu ikaweze kuwezekana kwa hivyo mwezi itisha mkono tu wa bwana todo guoko kwa jehova guoko kwa jehova akwewe raine maodo mothe mahaloga maga huana makobe ikaloga ama siadekere guoko kwa ga geukia mwanza kumulisa ni mambo gani imekushinda na imekulemea sana mambo gani imekushinda na imekulemea sana haleluya Kama kuna mambo imekushida na imekulemea. Kabla tufunge uu mwezi. Kuna mambo abao mungu ameweka dani yake. Raisi that sign and wonders will follow you. When the hand of God is upon you. you when the hand of God is upon you. You overtake them that went before you. Amen. <laughs> you don't want to be introduced. You don't want people to know you. You don't want an interview. But when the heart of God is upon you this month, every door that you'll be knocking, it will be open because the heart of God, mkono wa buwana, diyo utakuwa unafanya nini? Unakufungulia. Mkono wa buwana. The hand of God will be always upon us in the name of Jesus. I said you overtake them. That went before you. The hand of God... The heart of God provide even when the economy is bad. The heart of God that broke the hand of he broke block the, the 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 bodies of Haru the, the bodies the hand of God that that broke the head of Pharaoh when he was holding the children of Israel. It is the same same hand that is going to go before you. Once you invite God, 
no matter how giants they, they are fighting you, no matter how they are trying to magnify themselves. I was thinking about Joshua, Caleb, those who are sent to go and spy the rad. Ten of them, they came with a good report. And two of them, they came with a negative report because they knew that the heart of God is upon us. And we are well able, as long as we are two of us. The rest come and told Joshua, it cannot happen. Onagayagi umaigoro, goti gehote keka. Onagayagi oka, adwarea meko u, mahanake. Marimo, naivyeto hanake, dahi. No, adwere. Kareb and who? Kareb and Joshua, they came and told Moses, man of God, when we looked at the, ourselves, whatever those people are saying, it is true. But we are well able because they realized for you to be at Ben Hill meeting and be given a pulpit, it was not an easy thing. You called yourself a meeting and you said, My voice is well able, my dressing code is well able, my dancing there is well able, and I connect you with the greatness. Amen. I connect you with the greatness. Amen. I connect you with the greatness. Amen. Because you realized you are not alone. Ukona mungu ambaye anaperekana pamoja na wewe. Today I want to introduce you to a topic, the heart of God. The heart of God. Because I was thinking even about this ministry, how we run this ministry to speak the truth. To speak the truth. While let not the hand of God, who have, which has been catering all the bills of this church, because there is a lot of bills in this church. It is not about the offering. It is not about the, the tithe. And that's why you find myself. I don't emphasize so much in giving. Although I know once you give, you give for your own benefit. But I want to tell you, when I realize that the heart of God is more than tithe. The heart of God is more than money. The heart of God is more than anything. I wish you could be coming. We worship. We call upon the name of God. And the heart of God and your expectation shall be. So many churches are closed. And especially at the time of Corona. Many people close the church. Because they are trust. But when I realize the calling that I carry, it is from God. And there is no way God can forsake me. There is no time you'll hear the workers here complaining. Or the bills are not catered for. I introduced the heart of God upon my life. Paka umuondoe kwa nafasi ya mungu. Uweke mungu na umuabie mungu. Direda huwa kogo waku. Gotora nagia hamoe nani. The, the heart of God never fail. The heart of God never frustrate. But the heart of a human being. They can frustrate you. Waiting for you to go and kneel down for them. To go and rub their shoes. But when God is in presence. Watafuga ijia na mungu na mkono wake. Kuna jia atakufungulia. Ninataka kuinua mtu ambaye ako shini Unakona mabo unategemea Na ukiangaria unaona kama haifanyi Bwana anaweza akawashiria iyo jabo iwe gumu Ili ukaweze kutambua mkono wa mungu Ambia mtu tabua mkono wa mungu Mwambia tabua mko Ask somebody Have you ever experienced the hand of God? Have you ever asked your help to come from the heart of God? People may not bring. People may bring na magaya gaye. But when the heart of God stretches upon you, the Bible says that he uphold his hand. Akubotoraga guokogwake oroshine oroshine. Agatoradima naorea tuedete. Nyore wahoya mahoya mago kubatalero. Guokone gai. Kanohoya gado mago kubatolere. Na mago kubatolera. Maga go to a gobo. Kafago kuba to the one guy. Kafago kuba to the one guy. Toga yago kuba to the I divine ideas. No idea ginya teri. 
no we die ginya maratadi no we die ginya ushuru no we dagie ginya madadi tondu guoko kwa ngai ugikanda mutu gukanda nagia hamwe nawe guoko kwa ngai ugitwara madadi gutwara naga hamwe nawe kafa gutwara na guoko kwa ngai gukira gutwara na guoko kwa mutu hurira ngai witoruhi Isaiah 59 from verses 1 Isaiah 59 verse number 1 Behold the Lord's hand is not shortened that it cannot save nor is ear heavy that it cannot hear but our iniquities have separated you from your God the only thing that can make the heart of God not to assist neither to exist in your life when you live a life of iniquity when you live a life of rice, when you live an godly life, but I would love you this mother, if everything has come to an end, exercise the hand of God. Amen. Tell God my hand are weak. My supporters are weaker. The economy is weaker. But Lord intervene and let your hand, Father, be upon me. You have told me that your hand is not shorter, that it cannot help me. Your ears are not deaf, that it cannot hear me, Lord. If there is any iniquities, wash me and cleanse me because I need your hand. Amen. Tell somebody this month, this month you need the hand of god you need the hand of people god people may run away from you yeah. People may say so many things, <laughs> but they will be amazed <laughs> when they will find you and see you continuing with the journey. Little did they know when they left you, Gai Neokire, Nagoko Kwa Gai, Koke Gai Goroyak. Amen. Kafagotuara Nane Gai. Amen. Ne Kafakwe Dwane Gai, Wedoleo Tadi Iragamodo, Nakwe de Sokia Kwe, Kanagoti Yogo, Naga, Yurio Takua Ga, Nawedo. I'm introducing you something that people will be asking you, Digoko, and how did you make it? You will be telling them it is the hand of God. When I realize that it is only the hand of God, which can enable me, which can walk with me, which can uphold, which can bless me, I choose every morning when I woke up, when I'm on my way, to be asking, is the hand of God together with me? Many people are full of depression, stress, Bloody pressure. I thank God today. I said, let me take my mom to see how her health is. Praise be the name of God. And I, when I took my mom, she was told that her heart is there like a heart of a small baby. No pressure. Nothing. Nothing. And nothing. And nothing. And I bless God for that. Because I know when the hand of God is upon you, even demonic diseases will not locate you. They will try to come, but the hand of God will fight them in seven directions. What is the hand of the Lord? The hand of the Lord is God's supernatural ability to work wonders in your life. The hand of the Lord is God's supernatural ability to work wonders in your life. The hand of the Lord is God's divine intervention in your problem. The hand of the Lord. And I just want you to see you start applying the hand of God to the things that it seems as if they are difficult to your life. Tell God, Lakini mkono wako ukiingiria mungu, ii ni najua. Utaipigana na utanisaidia na utanibeba na mkono wako. Number three. The hand of the Lord is the force that moves mountain and is troubling blocks out of your life. And number four, the hand of the Lord is the power that brings a turnaround for the better in your life. Number five, the hand of the Lord is God's supernatural supply and provision for all your needs. Number six, the hand of the Lord is God's ability to sustain you in all season. And all situation. Number seven. The hand of the Lord is God's solution 
to all of your manikite problem. Examples of the hand of the Lord at work in the Bible. Elijah overtook Ahab when the hand of the Lord came upon him. Ahab was using a chariot with the horses and traveled from Samaria to Jezreel. Elijah, on the other hand, was going the same journey by the foot. But when the hand of the Lord came upon Elijah, he learned and overtake Ahab and arrived in Jezreel ahead of Ahab and his chariots. The hand of the Lord gives you speed and divine advantage over your competitors. You may not have the resources or a qualification or a connection that your competitors have. But when the hand of the Lord comes upon you and overtake them, you come upon you, you overtake them in every area of life. Isaiah, 1 Kings 18, 44 to 46. First Kings chapter 18, verse 44 to 46. Then, then it came to pass the seventh time that he said, There is a cloud as small as a man's hand rising out of the sea. So he said, Go up, say to Ahab, Prepare your chariot and go down before the rain stops you. Now it happened in the meantime that the sky became black with clouds and wind, and there was a heavy rain. So Ahab rode away and went to Jezreel. Mm -hmm. Then the hand of the Lord came upon Elijah, and he guarded up his loins and ran uh -huh, ahead of uh, Ahab. Just had a rain there. And the, then the hand of the Lord... Then the hand of the Lord, verse 46, came upon Elijah, and he guarded up his loins and ran ahead of Ahab to the entrance of Jezreel. Praise be the name of God. Amen. When the hand of God will rest upon you. No matter those who went before you. They went with their own ideas. Their own might. Their own strategies. But when divine hand come upon you. You will overtake them. That he built before you. You will overtake them. That he bought car before you. And yours will be good than them. Because the hand of God is involved in everything that you are doing. Clap for the Lord. <laughs> Number two. The heart of the Lord that brings provision and supply. David experienced the supernatural supply of God through his mighty hand. The children of Israel ate manna in the wilderness which rained from heaven God's had provided food for them. The hand of God never lands dry. When your pockets become empty and dry, set your, set your eyes on the hand of God. He will sanctify all your desires. Can you set your eyes to God tonight? Can you tell God that you are the only person who can meet and fulfill my desires? I set my heart to you. There are so many people who have promised you things. And all of a sudden, they disappeared. I know there are people who have budgets. There are those who are planning for wedding, dowry, projects. And when you look at the situation, it seems as if it is not telling. But when you look at heaven and you tell God, this is where my help, I need your hand. Let your hand read me. Let your hand rest upon me. Let your divine weed locate me. You will not be ashamed in the name of Jesus. Take a moment and focus to God. Take a moment and speak to your God. Take a moment. Umengangana sana. Umejaribu sana. Umeitwa paka majina. Unaonekana kama wewe ni mwenda wazimu. Unaonekana kama hata haustahili. God of Elisha. When Elisha prophesied about tomorrow, is God that I'm preaching that issue that is standing before you. That shame that has been knocking you at door. That familiar spirit that has been following you. 
for the spirit of God is telling us tonight, oh my God, that we focus upon the hand of God. That we focus upon the hand of God. He is able and he is going to enable us to overcome in the mighty name of Jesus. Psalms 145 from verses 15 to 16. Psalms 145, 15 to 16. The eyes of all look expectantly to you, and you give them their food in their due season. You open your hand and satisfy the desire of every living thing. Imagine every morning when you, when you woke up in your prayers. Remind God and pray with the Psalms 145, 15 to 16. Because you have a desire and tell oh God, once you open to others, do not forsake me. Do not leave me. Open for me, Lord, and meet this as my desire. I want to locate from this place. I want you, God, to give me a new home. I want you, God, to give me future. Uphold your hand and bless in Jesus' name. Amen. The right hand of God, the right hand of God, the rod is full of pleasure, partakers of them. The right hand of the Lord is full of pressures, partake of them today in Jesus' mighty name. Psalm 16, 11. Psalm 16, verse 11. You will show me the path of life. In your presence is fullness of joy. At your right hand are pleasures forevermore. Praise be the name of God. Amen. The topic that I wanted, because I've received so many calls from people, crying, complaining, seeing as if God is not worthy, seeing as if God is a God of time waster, he told me, go, introduce my people to my mighty hand. Because when the mighty hand of God is upon everyone, things will overturn. Things will change. He is going to provide for us. Stand on our feet. Let us welcome the man of God. Come and take us marathon. And God will bless you. The hand of God. Hallelujah. Let us appreciate Dr. There is something that the woman of God has said. In Psalms 145, 15. The Bible says, The eyes of all look expectantly to the Lord. How many have an expectation today? I was listening to a testimony yesterday online. Of a certain woman. Alitoka kwa ushago. Akaitwa na relative. Waje wakae na yeye. Anzia maisha pale. Katikati yake na umaskini, she only had 3,000. And one night, the relative told her, you need to get out of this house and go. Atukuitaji tena hapa. And the following day, early in the morning, akatoka kwa nyumba ya ule relative ambaye alikuwa metegemea sana. Don't put your trust in men. Ambia jirani usieke tumaini lako kwa watu. Tusiweke tumaini yetu kwa watu. Kwa mana waneza kuangusha. Bona asifiwe. Amen. Yule dada bishop alitoka na mfuko peke yake. Amen. Na elfu tatu alikuwa nayo kwa mfuko. Oh, hallelujah. And she left. Amen. Akazunguka kitafuta nyumba. Na ile nyumba alipata ilikuwa ya 3,500 deposit na 3,500 rent. Akaongea na keateka. Akamwambia mimi sina mahali pa kukaa na sitaki kurudi nyumbani. Keateka akamurumia akamkubalisha aingie pale aanze kuishi. And when she entered in that house, she was saying alikuwa na kasimu kenye ukitoa kwa chaja kanazimika. She said, sina kitu kingine. Let me just connect my phone na ningie Facebook. Alipoingia Facebook, akapata mtu amemtumia inbox. Anamuliza, how have you been na maisha imekuwa aje. Akamuambia, mimi na itaji tu miambili ni kule, nieza kusurvive Nairobi. Na simu ikazimika. The truth is this, Bishop. Ule dada alipolala when the hand of God comes Amen. upon you. Amen. Mtu ambaye wameona na Facebook hawajuani sana. Hallelujah. Alimtumia mpesa ya 12,000 
Kenya shillings. Jesus, amen. When the hand of God comes upon you, he can send you help from people you do not know. Ali chat nam to two kwa Facebook. With that 12,000, she went and began a business. And she was able to move forward and forward and forward. Kuna kitu ambacho daktari ya mesema. The hand of God came upon Elijah. Amen. Ahab alikuwa na farasi zake na gari zake. Amen. Elijah alikuwa na kimbia migu. Hallelujah. Huyu dada akaenda haka apply kazi. Amen. This same lady. Yes. To an organization mm. to do counseling. Mm. Wale ambao alikuwa anashindana nao. They had certificates and documents kutoka mashule makubwa. The hand of God was upon this woman. Hallelujah. She was selected. Amen. Akafanywa manager. Mm. Na akalipwa mshahara yake ya kwanza ya 40,000 Kenya shillings. Amen. The hand of the Lord. Amen. When it comes oh, upon you. Glory to Jesus. Daktari aneza kosa kukupatia pesa. Yes. Aneza kosa kukupea unga leo wende na yonyumba. Yes. Lakini ya mekuletea mkono wabona. Dio. Nigependa uinue mikono ya kuchu. Hallelujah. Na umuambia mungu ni mesikia oh, neno la nabi wangu. Neza kosa makaratasi. Neza kosa mambo mingi. Neza kosa godfather wakunifungulia njia. Neza kosa namba ya director. But Lord let your hand be upon me. Mkono iliokuwa juu ya Elijah. Ikafanya akimbia na ashinde mfalme. Iyo mkono yitisha dakika hii. Begin to tell God let your hand be upon me. In this job I am applying. In this tender I am looking for. In this business that I am doing. Wale ni nashindana nao wana makaratasi. Wana ujuzi kuniliko. Wana connection kuniliko. Wana pesa za kuhongana njia zitengeneza. Zeke. Mimi sina chochote za kunipigania Ila nina mkono wako buwana Naomba mkono wako nitangulie Begin to call the hand of the Lord Sijui ni kipi icho ambacho umengojea sana Na unaona ya kwamba haita wezekana Kwa mana hauna nguvu na hauna uwezo Kwa mana hauna msaada na hauna watu wakukukimbizia But when the hand of the Lord comes upon you It opens doors that no man can shut It makes a way where there seems to be no way. It connects you to people who you never knew. It gives you an advantage in life. Call for the hand of the Lord. Call for the hand of the Lord. The hand of the Lord can give you an inheritance in this city. Yawezekana kwenu wa uku wachua chochote. Uliambiwa ondoka na uende. But in this city of Nairobi, in that place where you are living, there is an inheritance that the hand of the Lord has prepared for you. My God and my Father, May your hand be upon me today. May your hand go ahead of me today. The four lepers had nothing. Walikuwa metolewa inje ya mji. Walikuwa mekatazwa kuka. Walikuwa menyimu uhusiano na watu. Kwa ajili ya ukoma wao. Lakini wakati mkono wabwana. Ulishuka juu yao. Mungu waliinua hatu wazao. Mungu walielekeza nyayo zao. Walikuta kambi ya maaseria. Imeja chakula na mavazi. Imeja adhabu na feather Na maaseria walikuwa meondoka Wale wenye ukoma wa ambao walikuwa mekataliwa They became millionaires 